recently we had a firearm that was recovered from a Brooklyn Park case that we were able to link to six other unsolved shootings. So when we see information like that through our database being produced in that way, we know it's a very valuable investigative tool. I'm Stephanie Eckerman and I'm a forensic scientist and firearms examiner with the Hennepin County Sheriff's Office Forensic Science Laboratory. I am responsible for the examination of firearms-related evidence, firearms that are recovered from crime scenes, from shooting scenes, as well as fired evidence. Because of the way that firearms are manufactured, the manufacturing process leaves behind unique features, unique surfaces, and then during the firing process, those unique surfaces are transferred to the fired cartridge case. The features that are left behind during the firing process are unique to that firearm and then unique to that cartridge case that's being fired. So NIBIN stands for National Integrated Ballistics Information Network. It's basically a database of images of fired cartridge cases that we are able to constantly be searching against when new evidence comes to the laboratory. I'm the Assistant Special Agent Charge of ATF in St. Paul Field Division. My name is Jeff Reed. By using NIBIN, you can link individual shooting scenes to either determine patterns or potential suspects for those shooting scenes. There are 200 sites all over the world that uh, use this technology. Here in Minnesota, we have three agencies that are actively using the NIBIN database. Minneapolis PD has access to the NIBIN database, as well as the BCA, the Bureau of Criminal Apprehension in St. Paul, and then here at Hennepin County Sheriff's Office. Hennepin County Sheriff's Office was ideal for the placement of the NIBIN machine, and that's due to Hennepin County not only servicing the citizens of Hennepin County, but also the local jurisdictions located within uh, Hennepin County. As far as crime gun intelligence, NIBIN, the investigative work the men and women of Hennepin County Sheriff's Department our office are doing daily, and of ATF, Pulling those rare sets and that information together for their successful prosecution is making an impact. Recently, we had a NIBIN entry that then was linked to 25 other cases. So that's showing that somehow those 25 cases are linked together, are associated together, whether it's the same firearm being used or um, evidence from one case is being linked to evidence from another case. So it's not uncommon at all for us to be able to create these leads and find these links between cases.